welcome this is the energy vibration reading for the Capricorn Sun Moon and Rising sign and I have to look and see if it's working yeah for the Capricorn Sun Moon and Rising sign I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back um, the energy of this quarter for you guys is the energy of victory and success so this is going to be a successful quarter for you Capricorns uh, the energy of the chariot is always success and victory after an horrible situation that has transpired and uh, um, the working of a lot of situation and people around you okay so uh, congratulations for you Capricorn who has been going through an horrific period because a lot of Capricorns has been you know connecting and saying oh my god when is this is going to over and it is now going to be finally op over in the first three quarters okay whatever that has transpired for you Capricorns was a situation where people have a big been doing a stuff and hurting and doing a lot of situation there's there has been a lot of people who were being a very dishonest not speaking um, up and not and, and have been very dishonest and trying to get away with certain things uh, and all of this is finally coming out and you're finally removing because if you look at these two horses that you are moving forward and you're balancing out the positive and the negative and moving forward with your life in whatever way it was okay and and I can really understand um, you Capricorns for whatever situation that you're being victorious and successful over because trust me it's the same energy vibration I have to deal with as a Capricorn because I've never seen so many things happen in a one time in my life Wow um, I'm so 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 happy as 2017 is over because I've never seen so many people lie and and, and deceiving and and, and, and and do things and you find out how your family are and you find out how people are and you meet strangers and you think I will not let anyone else in my life or close to me <laughs> so I'm sure that a lot of you Capricorns are feeling the same way because it was not 2017 it was really really a karmatic year it was uh, it was such a karmatic year I I I was I thought that I was finishing off but I you know um, then when you realize it's that the more you become spiritual and the more you have positive light around you is the more you attract these negative people I remember I was doing a phone reading with someone and she says oh my god you you know that um, and I'm saying as I said yes it's, it's just what happened especially um, whenever you're very spiritual you're very positive you have a clean heart and this is how um, this is how you can know who what is the characteristic of someone and this a lot of people needs to learn this if you have met someone and seen people hating so just hating the person and speaking things that you're not aware if they're true or not true then you know that that person is on the spiritual part and they are having the um, spiritual light because what is happening is that I've seen it I uh, you know there are certain people who attract to me and they carry such a low energy vibration until I have learned so many message um, lessons in 2017 and um, I have one family member that I think you are the only person that I really oh no to <laughs> my son and um, my um, my cousin that I think you know you're you know you're always walking in my videos crazy as you are but uh, um, you're a very honest person you have a good heart your heart is at the right place but I have met some people on my journey and I can't say that everybody who I've met because I've met wonderful nice honest people but I have reached a point in my life that I um, keep people at a distance I no longer um, going to open up myself to people or no longer going to extend an end to people because I realize that I am attracting the most uncomfortable and it is 
my way of cleansing and easing healing karma but what I've been through in 2000 and from 2012 my I have been moving on the ascension part and trust me oh my gosh <laughs> <laughs> I'm like sometimes I, I was like I can't wait until this year finish um, because wow so for you Capricorns out there I know what you're going through I'm going through basically the same thing and sometimes you can see it on my energy vibration like I have a chemist who will call me and said so what happened when you were doing those videos <laughs> because obviously something happened I saw it I remember I was looking back on one of the videos and I was thinking oh my god yes it was that day oh you know because every time I'm, I'm trying to bring out the positivity and I'm trying to find the positivity in things and people but I realize it's just my karma it's just that um, I came in to help other people with their karmas I am the foremost point to help other people with their karmas because someone has to be the subject of whatever the situation is so that those people can communicate or connect with other people but I'm you know when I when I leave this planet I am going to be so happy because I've never I could never ever vibrate on this planet because of the lower energies that is here and because I can't imagine why people don't speak the truth and why people lie and why people are so jealous because of somebody else how can you how can you be jealous of someone why you haven't known their story you have known what they have been through um, people who uh, um, uh, exhilarating life has gone through so much and you 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 can see people and then you are going to have an opinion about someone and you're going to be jealous of someone everyone has um, received the same guidance and the same thing so you know you Capricorns not to worry the squirtle is going to finally you're going to be victorious in the squirtle let's look at your your energies you have in January the energy of a new journey you're starting a new journey you're beginning a new journey you're going on a new journey a lot of new projects I'm seeing happening a lot of good things um, a lot of you are changing your ways your being a lot of you are going on a new journey in January and this is going to be wonderful this is going to be wonderful in the month of February a lucky month for you um, Capricorns whatever is happening for you Capricorns February is going to be a good month um, yes whatever you're planning on doing um, go ahead and do this because it's going to be a success whether it's a project whether it's publishing a book whether it's writing something whether it's starting something for yourself whether it's whatever you're going to do in the month of February or studying something or going to start with a new organization go ahead and do it because it's going to be good whatsoever is going to happen in this first quarter love is going to be wonderful um, a lot of you are going to be meeting your twin flame and soul mates okay a lot of you are going to be meeting your twin flame and soulmate especially in the month of March it is going to be happening for you guys so the first quarter for you guys is the quarter of victory and success February is going to be a very lucky month the month of March is going to be the month of love in a lot of ways January is going to be a new beginning so let's see let's call upon the angels and guides to show us the energy for what is connecting January to February for the Capricorns um, you have the king of wands you have the king of wands so what is happening with the energy of what is connecting you from one month to another is the energy of the king of wands so you are victorious and successful over the king of ones whoever this king of ones is this is someone over the age of 40 that is a um, 
an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius. Whatever this person has done to you, you are being victorious over this person. You can see that you're moving on a new beginning, and you can see that energy of the sun in February. So whatever has transpired, you're moving away from this um, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarian, and you're moving forward in your life and the energy of the sun. So you have victoriously come out of this situation for what this person has done okay let's move forward and let's see what is the energy of the Sun and the lovers is going to do for you this is obviously Sun and the lovers new love <laughs> okay I'm sorry <laughs> I'm sorry but um, I did say that um, the um, energy of the um, new love is coming your soulmate and twin flame so between the months of February and um, March new love is coming in for a lot of you Capricorn so a lot of you people are going to be meeting these could be new babies um, being born um, and grandchildren or new babies yourself is pregnant new babies are being born um, new situation whatever and this is what I'm saying in the month of February whatsoever is happening going on in the month of March is going to be a good positive uh, situation because you have the ace of cups the ace of cups is new love coming in and this is going to be wonderful and positive let's see what is the outcomes of whatever that has happened and whatever that has transpired you have a transformation and this is good so this is really a period of transformation because what is happening is that you're victorious and successful over a negative period in your life and in January you have a new beginning in in February um, the Sun comes out and in March you are having the energy of the lovers that is here and this is positive so for you Capricorns you're ending the year 2017 beginning the year 2018 with the energy of transformation and this is a very positive this is a very very positive energy so what is happening is that you're moving away um, you have victoriously overcome the obstacles that this king of um, this king has placed in your way and it could be an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius that place obstacles in your way and you have overcome these obstacles and victoriously successful come out of this and then when we look there's new love coming in for you between February and in February and March new love is going to be here for you so some of you can have this new love coming in in the month of February some of you can have this new month in the uh, in, in the month of March so the transformation this is going to be good because there is an ending there is an ending that is coming in um, towards the king of wands there is an ending so let's see what's the relationship card is saying for you capricorns um by my attention to things i am making choices okay what do people don't understand is that uh, you do not choose some things uh, by looking at it and shouting yes I would like to have something you make your choices and your desires and if this is an energy that already come out and for the general energy I think and what is happening is what they're saying to you is that you attract things to you if you think about them you attract them to you and this is what is happening so you know whatever is happening let's look and see what else is going to happen for the activation we're calling up an Archangel Metatron what energies the Capricorn needs to use in the first quarter of this period and you have the 10 authority authority so the 10 authority the frequency of authority reminds us that true authority is the powerful direct and realization yet receptive wise and loving okay so however you bring out the authority in your life you have to do it in a way that is going to bring wisdom and um, um, wisdom in a positive way and being very receptive and wise and loving whatever this situation and whatever is happening okay so 
as we move forward believe it says believe and it has the energy vibration and the frequency so um, you and the Virgos got two um, energy vibration and I shuffle them very well apparently not but you have oratory and belief 10 and 11 so obviously you um, earth sign should be receiving the two energies and what belief said the frequency of belief support our sense of self worth based on our gifts and talents and a strong connection to source okay these are the two positive cards that you have these are the two um, positive cards that you receive authority and believe okay and you know this is what is happening for a lot of you Capricorns as I said uh, I you know I really truly vibrate I love having um, doing a reading for Capricorn people because I am so intensely um, uh, carrying the, the same energy vibration as they do different circumstances different time and different situations um, because um, I really do connect and especially as I'm doing a reading I you know do my reading very um, with um, in depth of what exactly is happening in a situation and uh, for you um, Capricorns whatever is happening um, there is a new start that is going to happen whoever this king of ones is he, there is a trans there's a debt and transformation that is coming at him whatever he has um, um, whatever he has created as your obstacles uh, is now coming to an end and new love is about to start for you new love is about to start for you so as you see it's like a V and then the energy of the Sun comes out over it and this is wonderful because you're going on a new beginning leaving this king of ones behind and he's coming to an end there's a death and transformation transformation and you need to believe that so whatever has transpired between you and this um, energy of the king of because it could be an Aries it could be a Leo and it could be a Sagittarius whatever that has transpired this was not good this person has tried to um, you know make blockages everywhere and the truth is coming out because um, you are victorious over the situation because this man has created so many obstacles so many things he has place people things and 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 situation against you um by making mischief and lying and whoever he is whether he's an aries for some people whether he's an um a leo for some people whether he is an um, sagittarius for some people uh, you are moving away from this person and there is coming and transition and this transition is coming and healing from the energy the Sun because he has lied and create so many things and now new love is going to be happening for you new things is going to be happening and whatever the authority whatever the power you have use it in a good way and believe your um, whatever you think and whatever you believe you will find the inner wisdom and guidance to move you forward in your life okay I want to say thank you for being here listen to your Sun moon and rising sign this is just a, a first quarter energies and I want to say namaste until next time mm -hmm.